Hello everyone, in this video, I will show you how to convert TSV files into .csv format. I have a bunch of TSV files on my desktop. These files originally came from IMDB. If you go to the IMDB dataset website and navigate to their download section, you can download these TSV files. So this is where I found this is where I found these files. If you've worked with CSV files, TSV is very similar. The only difference is that TSV uses tabs instead of commas. Uh, so if you open this file, uh, you see you see these columns. We have this column, this column, and this column. And in between, you see these little spaces. These are tabs. If this was a CSV file, you would have seen commas instead of tabs. This TSV format should work for pretty much everything, um, but for some reason, if it doesn't work well in your environment, you can try and convert them into CSV. So if you happen to know a little bit of Python, you can use this conversion tool I've made. You can download this tool from my website. You'll see a download link in the description text. So this is what the file looks like. I won't go into too much detail because this course is about SQL, not Python. But I'll just point out that there's a lot of housekeeping going on here, um, like grabbing the file name. But um, what really matters is this line and this line. I'm basically using pandas read table function to read the original file and then exporting the table into a .csv format. So all you have to do is download this convert.py file and open the terminal or open the PowerShell if you're using Windows and then change the directory to where the file is. And when you do that, make sure all the TSV files are in the same folder. And just run the file by typing python space convert.py. And it's going to ask for a file name. So I'm going to copy and paste one of the files. I'll copy this title.ratings.tsv and hit enter. And it's going to do some processing on the background. It should export a new file into the same folder. Um, and now it's asking for another file name. So I'll just keep going like this type in the name for uh, the second file, name.basics.tsv and it's doing some processing and you see a new file, new CSV file popping up in this window. Uh, this might take a few seconds because this file is a little bit larger. Uh, the first one was only about 20 meg, uh, this one is about 600 meg. So it's a little bit heavier to process. Okay, now there's a new file here. Um, there's nothing in the file yet. Uh, it's still populating the file. Okay, um, I will leave it running like this, but you can basically repeat the same process and convert all these files into .csv. And if you're not comfortable using Python yourself, that's okay. I've prepared all these CSV files in the same website. Um, so if you want to skip this step and just grab the CSV files, you can do that too. Follow the download link, grab the CSV files, and go to the next video for more SQL exercises. Okay, this is it for this video. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video.